Alvana. Oh, hey. Okay, get up. Oh, hey guys, all right, so um, when did you know that you were an interior designer? You know, it's kind of sprouted from a young age, I guess you could say. I always saw myself decorating Club Penguin, Animal Jam. Gotcha, gotcha. And what would you say that your ideal room style is? Um, I'm gonna say just all around very girly. Right now, my bedroom is really niche. It's like a little slept on. Just like huh? my bed is really oh. more often than it should be, oh. but um, kind of a beauty is in the eye of the beholder type situation. Gotcha, gotcha. No boys come in, so I do with that. Understood. Yeah, so I haven't addressed the elephant in the room for the lack of the elephant in the room. I don't. I have three walls in my room, <laughs> and I don't have a door. My room is literally a portal <laughs> to the kitchen. I used to <laughs> curl over the wall into my room when I was a kid. Thanks for having us for 73 questions. Oh, of course, yeah. You stop back when I have four walls and a door in my room. Gotcha, gotcha. So right here, you'll see I have a door. Wasn't there before. Over here, you'll see I have a wall. Was not there before. Well, if you come back this way, this is a new addition. I just really like this silk. This is so far from silk. silk. It is for aesthetics, but also it's to cover whatever lies behind there. But I did really want to quickly go over the stuff that I got from Ikea. So this first drawer is my hair drawer. Here I have headbands. This is also headbands, barrettes. All my bows love scrunchies, hair ties, mini elastic hair ties for more complex hairstyles, even though I wear my hair the same every day. Combs and toothbrushes for my baby hairs. Each drawer has its own like special thing, so. And <laughs> this is my technology drawer. It does look like a junk drawer, but I promise everything in here has a purpose. Um, These are all my props for the videos that you guys love. <laughs> so I have a Santa Claus hat in here, a bunch of caps and wigs for when I need to be someone that's not myself. This is my true junk drawer. So I have tattoos in here, teeth whitening strips. Everyone always asks what I use for my teeth. It's this and I use this Crest 3D white toothpaste. It's just all so random. Nail polish remover, ballet shoe that probably doesn't have a matching pair. Are you kidding me? And like uh -huh. PR, iconic London. Uh I'm American, but thanks London. My pronouns are U-S-A. Okay. Give me a second, bro. Woo. And these are my clothes. I'm not, this is like, it's just a completely defective part of the room. But also, I wanna like hang flowers here to cover the black curtain, cause it's bothering me. Okay, so this I think is probably my favorite corner of the room. It's my bed. Something that I didn't freaking know is when you wanna change the pattern of your bed or whatever, you don't have to buy a completely new comforter. I didn't know that duvet covers existed. This is the same comforter I had in my old room. I just got this from Amazon and it's so cute. Also, it's reversible. It comes with like matching things and I have silk pink pillowcases. This, I also got like all of these from Amazon. Just a cute little collage. And then I have a love letter. <laughs> Bro, I'm blushing right now, bye. So if you like, <laughs> um, it's, actually a recipe for chocolate chip cookies <laughs> but it's practically the same thing because that's my love language and this is the one that chocolate I, chip cookies yeah, specifically are yes. your love language everyone that knows me knows like top three for my favorite foods i literally dusted eyeshadow on it to make it look like age this I have for when I'm editing. Any point of time in the day, 
I am here editing. But um, yeah, it's just so convenient. This is also for Amazon. Everything you see in this video can be bought on Amazon, trust. This is a 15 pound weighted blanket. And then this is something I am so proud of because I did this completely by myself. I actually did it myself. And if you look even closer, I made, I didn't make the ribbon, I made the bow with my own hands. But I just like, if you back up and like really, it's just so pretty. And it, it adds something to the room. Okay, this, this is an apartment, okay? These are clothes that I'm donating. And I have to have an air purifier in my room because I have really bad seasonal allergies. And this isn't coquette at all either. I just do it because this is my new YouTube space. So the light has to go this way, so I have to keep it here. This is my filming, makeup, and working space. I didn't <laughs> I always have a protein shake here because I'm forcing myself to drink these every day now because I'm trying to actually gain weight. I'm saying that, but I'm gonna like just eat snacks all day again starting tomorrow. But here is my little makeup organizer. I got this from Amazon. Shocking. Um, I'm not gonna lie. These are all the more aesthetic looking makeup products that I have and all of the stuff. <laughs> she uses in there so it's just completely unesthetic but it's cool because they have these little organizers I got these organizers online um where online on anyways the coasters being from Amazon also uh, this is my little jewelry organizer because I had to make my like vanity into a working space at the same time I got the thing that holds my computer because apparently it's bad to spend your day like this. I don't know what the fuck that's about. So this kind of like elevates it because your computer should be at eye line. Here's my phone, love. It just fits the whole room. This, I love. What's cool about this is it's like touch screen. I keep my crown here because if I wear it every day, people are gonna call me a narcissist. So at least when I look in the mirror, I could be kind of wearing it. Let's demonstrate. <laughs> the cool thing about this is it's touch screen. Uh, so, it's so cool. I love doing my makeup here. I just feel so high tech. I have no idea what this button does. PP. Try it. Wait. See, I don't, I'm so scared. I, I'm probably just like set off a bomb or something. This is the Mound Desk from Ikea. It's so versatile for whatever you guys want to do. I don't know. It's versatile for making a mess. Yeah, that too. But if you have better organizational skills than me, like it, literally everything is in here. I don't know why. This is oh, like a I secondary do. junk yeah. drawer. Yeah, <laughs> I, I do know what this is for. You'll, you'll see that in a second. In my chair. This isn't very coquette, but because of my I have my YouTube shorts pillow because I love YouTube. Gonna rep it any chance I get. And then down here, these, I was supposed to hang these up. It's supposed to be my vision board. I can rip that off now because I graduated. And then these boxes. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're not gonna go through that one. Where's the memory? That's like so pretentious. It's just two MacBook boxes in there. Why am I like collecting it? I should just get Everybody it. does that. Yeah, I don't know I a single person that doesn't keep their stuff. This, right. this is it. I've always had like a keepsake box. Memories in here. This was from the Ed Sheeran concert. This is me and Elijah. This is from small businesses. Every birthday card that I've ever gotten is in here, or at least when I gained the conscience to start collecting them. Literally a CD with my x-rays on it. This is me as the Little Mermaid. I liked it before it was trending, so that's just the evidence. This was the first time that I had a dorming experience when I was a camp counselor. This girl would like hang up these personalized notes on everyone's doors in the morning. It was so nice, so I kept that. This was the script for when I got scammed, if you guys remember that vlog. <laughs> this, I literally just have every magazine that I've ever been in. That seems a little narcissistic of you. It's not! The first magazine that I was in, my parents like didn't get multiple copies, so they just started going ham for all the other ones. And then here is another window, and then, then we have my Taylor wall. Love. The only thing though is Taylor does like to sometimes use some no-no words. That was what the emoji stickers were for. Oh no. This is why I got it. You never know which one. Literally so. bought emoji stickers. <laughs> oh my gosh, wait. Here, I'll just put a knife. Vigilante. It kind of goes with the thing. Vigilante. 
100k subscriber plaque. I intentionally left this space open over here for the a million plaque because I'm just silly like that. It like motivates me because when I film a video, I'm sitting behind this blank wall and I'm like, Frick. I have to pump those videos out so I can fill the wall. And then we have my pink cart. I did this myself with my bare freaking hands, bro. So I have this cute coquette bag. If you couldn't tell, the recurring theme in this room is pink and flowers. And also more pink flowers here. A bunch of gel pens, and then all my silly little books here. Summer I Turn Pretty, love. How to win friends and influence people. That sounds so manipulative, I promise it's just like a self-help thing. I also have Awaken the Giant. These books do not match the vibe of the room at all. It's like, how to dominate life, and then it's just Sailor <laughs> A bunch of crowns in here. I have grip gloves because I rip my calluses in the gym. I have ballet shoes here. Physical therapy equipment. In pink, of course. And then down here, I have my waxing pot, also pink. Waxing beads, also pink. Gel curing thing. Um, these are all my nail polishes. Pink basket, all the little cute colors. Come this way. We're going under the sea, bro. I'm actually not pulling the bins out. This. I want to play like Law and Order music. This looks so suspicious. It's just this like pink and white room, and I just pull this black briefcase up. This is where all the rest of my makeup goes. What the freak? <laughs> I have this Connor. I specific. I have a vivid memory of a girl making fun of me for this because I told her I got it from the thrift shop. This is when it wasn't cool to go thrifting. Like, geez, it's not that serious. Bro! I don't know, there's something about having a big black briefcase under your bed. It throws them off. Like, if someone were to come in and, like, try to take things from you, they'd be scared. They'd be like, oh, well, she definitely has weapons in there. And then it's just, like, a setting spray. A head massage. <laughs> okay, yay! Alright. Get out. Who is a liner? Who this TikToker got it poppin'? Educated, only 14.